What is going on everyone and welcome back to another episode of Craftopia. My name is Jexums and today we're going to be hopefully getting leveled up a little bit level wise and uh, power wise in general. Those are kind of like the same thing but in a different way today. Something we haven't had a chance to do before today. Uh, if you guys missed the last episode, go ahead and check that one out. It should be in the top right corner. Go watch that and come back here and join us, all right? All right, so in between this episode and the last one, um, I, I, I've done some stuff, uh, a little bit of things. Uh, the uh, actual, I actually didn't get a chance to post the episode that I recorded in between this one uh, and the last one. Uh, it, well, I did record it. The, the file was kind of like messed up, so I didn't get a chance to post it. It was like all messed up and it would not have made for a good video. So uh, I did a lot of stuff uh, after I realized that happened and decided I'd come back with something to actually show since uh, it wasn't really going well that episode i, I did a thing that I, I'm, I'm actually excited to show you guys it's it took a lot of it took a lot of time and effort uh to put into this thing but i actually got it done it's not completely finished but it's a start so um let, 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 let me go ahead and show you guys all right so uh, this this isn't anything new um this is just the base of the tower where i said that we would be building our house and it's still our house. I've, I've done a little bit to uh, improve it. There's a second floor and there's just a staircase and a long staircase. I really hate this staircase, but I had to make it tall enough to where I was happy with it. And then here's like our main area. Like I didn't do, I, I like I said, I didn't do much. I said it took me a couple hours to do this. It did. And for all that it is, it doesn't seem like much, but I, I got a, I, I basically everything's moved. This is all obviously all of our buildings and our cookers and these are labeled chests that have this is all of our stuff. The only thing that I have not moved is the farm because I feel like that could stay there. That doesn't necessarily need to be over here. I could keep that area as like a farm area. I think it looks good. I still have plans for this. I, uh, I'm either going to build it higher or build it out. I don't know. I, I don't want to completely cover up the tower. Um, since, I mean, it's there, I might as well not cover it up. But I do want to have more areas here to distinguish the areas, like a kitchen area and stuff. So that, like, all this, like, stuff isn't just jumbled into one area. Uh, but yeah, this is, this is what it is for now. So what we have in store for today is, uh, like I said, I figured out something new that, uh... I hadn't really been too sure about before and I finally figured it out by pure coincidence. I didn't look it up. I just I was being inquisitive. I was I got I got an itching to like click a button and I clicked it and something happened and I actually am mad at myself for not trying it sooner. R remember how we needed scrolls for enchanting? Well, I, I figured out it boggles my mind that they go in the same consumable area as my food. But yeah, um, uh, yeah, I found out how I get scrolls. And I think I just need to learn how to have better reading comprehension because the game kind of did tell me with tooltips how to get scrolls. I just wasn't listening. <laughs> More so, I didn't actually realize that if you, um, if you hold, I just dropped it. If you uh, hold on to the crystal, and you can i use it yeah if i just like use it like this i just get um enchanting scrolls look at that In insightful muscular ancient insightful do they all stack oh thank god they all stack i was hoping that i wouldn't just have a whole shit ton of scrolls in my inventory now um yeah so now we have a way to put on enchantments which is great now i just need to find i guess the right ones for what i want to enchant with because i don't exactly know how this works yet i guess I, I would go into the enchantment table uh and drop do i just do i just drop the scrolls in i don't know how this works consume enchanting scroll like do i have to click on these as well wait a second what happens if i just oh okay gotcha i just click on these i use them all uh, I see now. So now if I put my staff in here, I used all my scrolls. So now on my empty slot, okay. I see how this works. Not that any of these uh, actually work with my my weapons. I think, could I, can I enchant my armor too? Or can I just do 
weapons. I suppose I could probably do my armor too. That wouldn't make sense to not be able to. Oh wait, I could, I could put this on. Insightful still gives me ma more magic attack. And now, what is this called? I'm assuming I won't be able to use this enchantment afterward. All right, it'll be used up, but now I have the fourth enchantment. I'm gonna take a lot more damage, which is gonna blow, but it's worth it for the damage. It's always worth it for the damage. I also have more magic crit, which I didn't even know was a thing. But now, like, if I put my armor in here, can I... Okay, so I can put it on armor, and now I need another scroll of insightful if I want to do that again. Okay. Oh, and I think... I... Okay, these are very, very small stars, but I guess that means... I can only have a certain amount of stars from each enchantment on it, so I can't go over that. Okay, I get it. Magic attack increases by 1% of defense. That's actually not too bad. It'd be nice. All right, well, I happen to have um, a fair few weapons that need their the crystals extracted, so let's see what other... I probably should have, you know, de-enchanted these items first, but... um. Where am I? My old stuff is in this chest, only labeled old and unused gear. What do I have that needs removed? Just this one? I could have I could swear that I have more stuff that needs. Unless it's just the stuff that I have on me and that's it. Huh. I don't have as much as I'd like. But I can still go get some more scrolls, so let's go and pay someone to extract our shit for us. And there we go. And now I have four more. What scrolls can I get from this? It's just one cold-blooded, capricious, uneven, and unstable. I think the only one I had there already was unstable. The other three are new, so let's figure out what those are once I get up to the top of this damn place. I need to really put a box around this so I can actually just run without having to worry about falling off soon enough. All right, scrolls. Use all of those. And now I should be able to, do I, well, let's first see what they are. I don't know what they are, so let's just check it out with this, because it might be something I want to put on this instead. Uh, what do we have? We have attack, don't want that, attack, physical, ancient is, oh, that's the one I was looking at already, but it's good, still good. Um, uneven, oh, oh, but that drops by... Oh my god, what the hell? <laughs> Why would I ever want to do that? Magic attack minus 100. Magic attack also minus 300%. Like, how in the hell am I supposed to get any damage out of that? Like, I get that the critical damage... Is that the... Per wait, is that how often I crit or is that the damage? Those are two very different things. If I'm getting sacrificed just so I have a higher chance of critting instead of the damage going up, I would be livid. Uh, the only thing I'm interested here in is Ancient. I can put this on one of my armor pieces uh, and I'll be happy, I suppose. I guess either one of these really works. This is probably what I'm going to keep because it's still giving me great defense. And since I'm running something that's going to be defense, I might as well. Why can't I do it? I see that that... It's number there is red. Why can't I put it on here? You cannot apply the same enchantment to an item. I'm not trying to. Why can't I apply it at all to this item? Is what I want to know. I'm sort of confused now. I don't know why I can't put it. Can I put it on this? Surprisingly, this has an enchantment. Huh. I'm so glad that didn't work, because I would have been so upset if I enchanted the axe, uh, the, the goblin club, I mean. Why can't I put it on it? Well, I was just that close to being able to understand uh, how enchanting works, and then it um, confused me with whatever just happened, because I can't put that enchantment on. Uh, literally any of... I can't put any enchantment on anything else, actually. The only thing that I still have enchanted is this, this staff, which I'm, I'm glad it's enchanted. It's just, I don't... I don't get it. <laughs> I know I said we'd be doing some enchanting because I finally figured something out. I didn't figure shit out, apparently. I just understand how to get scrolls now. It, it won't let me put it on literally anything. And I I don't I don't get it. Okay, well, I'm done here. I, I tried. I tried my, my best. I'm going to clothe myself again and 
Uh, I'm interested in going to go uh, go find our excavators and see how much they've been pulling in. And then also I'd like, do I have my potion on me? I do, okay. I may end up in the Sherbert biome today, uh, hunting for adamantite again, because the grind doesn't stop for uh, more powerful tools. If this thing doesn't have any iron in it at all, I'm gonna be so pressed, because what the hell is the point of me having these monoliths on it if they're not gonna actually do anything to keep my iron production going? It worked well for the first one. That one actually produced, I don't know. I, I checked before and they weren't seeming like, yep, they were seeming like they weren't doing fuck all. I was on for like four hours the other day when I was building the house. And this thing has 65 fucking iron in it? That doesn't make any sense. Like, someone correct me if I'm wrong, but it's just as simple as placing the monolith down. I wonder if it's a matter of I have to keep... I don't think I have to keep this on. That would be stupid, right? I didn't have... I didn't have the boundary on when I was doing the other ones, so I don't see why I would need to i'm gonna actually still grab this iron before i dip because i do in fact still need well i don't need this iron i actually need the copper i just want to see if this one was working because it wasn't before and still freaking not which is very annoying and we only have 30 here i love this i love how chunk loaders work i love how these things work i want to build an automatic animal killer we're gonna go visit Anubis first, but I want to build an automatic animal killer. I, I mean, I, yeah, I want to. I, mainly because I need to, for, for this tower, like, for the tower, I don't need to do something as, as big as an automatic killer, but it would make my life probably easier in the future if I just had one. Uh, which one uses Anubis? I think it's this one. All right, newbie. Newbie, newbie, newbie. Exchange soul orbs. Okay. Uh, I have a large amount of soul orbs because remember how I said that shit duplicates on your body if you um uh, gather it out of the, the that grave that I died at at the end of the world yeah well I, I did and I accidentally duplicated my soul orbs so I'm just gonna use them all anyway <laughs> I might only go half because it's kind of unfair that I did duplicate them but the soul orbs are like kind of easy to grab so I don't feel bad it just kind of saves me a lot of time but also i probably get stuff a lot sooner than i would have so i'm only gonna go half for now genuinely um but i will use my slates of growth and increase my my mana do i want to do i want to increase my mana i don't know I, I, don't, I don't know man i don't know i've only got three or i've only got room to do two so let's just do i've already increased my mana before let's just go again and because things hurt i'm gonna increase my life yep makes sense to me okay i i wanted to explore this over here for like the longest time and i feel like it's about time i i do it i know that this is gonna be all over the place i have things that i want to do but i'm also like very get, uh, easily sidetracked so what is this is this an ancient the hell this is never this was never here before these were genuinely never here before i was in this area a lot at one point i'd never seen that there and it's like the only one in the area what the hell nope nope there's another one i don't need these parts i'm actually Ooh. yo hold on I need rare leather. Is that a chest? I need rare leather. And I don't know what drops it, but I need to start killing things in hopes that they drop it. Oh, nice lantern. So these, um, poor deer. Why is my staff not in my right key? Here we go. Uh, let's grab this. Let's... I would activate my food, but I am running low on the good stuff. So I'm not... Okay, listen. Okay, uh, that wasn't at me. I don't know why I thought it was going to be at me. I just want the deer. Where the hell did they go? Did they just run off the mountain? God damn it. He made me scare him off. This is going to suck. Y'all know how much I hate these guys. This is l actually, you know what? Hold on. It's not going to suck if I can just run past him. Just 
Haha, <laughs> see, I'm a smart freaking cookie. Oh my god, he's level 40. Okay, guys, I'm I might be making a mistake. Javla. Oh my god. I might be making a mistake not putting food on here. Oh my god, I'm making the biggest mistake not putting food on. Okay. Um, this is not how I thought this was gonna go. I actually would like to live here and not make a fool of myself. So we're gonna fight him like a why did that stop? Uh yep. Just gonna go this way. And where are my spells? Okay. As long as the guys behind me don't come and fight me, you know what? I'm A-OK -okay with this situation. Ouch. Ow. You, you, you. Is it, did I, did I live because I landed in the water or did I live because I was knocked? Yeah, I think I lived because I landed in water. I'm pretty sure that should have killed me. Right, so I've decided that we're going to move forward with uh, creating a slaughter house for some animals i still just need to figure out how it works i think there's a few things i need to capture but i definitely think that i need um what's the name i need conveyor belts i think i may actually already have conveyor belts i have to check and see i know i have a ton of stuff in here that i just haven't used yet these are downward ones i mean they'd work i just need conveyor belts i'll Adjust it to however I need. I just need them. There's something else I'm going to need. I'm going to need green monos. This is going to be a great time to test this because I've never done what I'm about to do before. So I don't know how to set it up. So it's going to be fun. Um, I've read that uh, using green monos, you're able to like heal entities. I'm not too sure of how it works, but we're going to figure it out. I think it's something about when you hit them with water. So I don't know really how this is going to work. If I just like sit a bunch of monos in water, wouldn't that kill them then? Since entities take water damage? I don't know. We'll figure it out. Even if it doesn't work out the way I'm wanting, it'll still be a breeding facility that has some merit. All right, cool. Two pushing to the center, two putting out. And now let's place the breeder. All right, you're going to have to get free build it because you are able to be placed there. I just don't know why you don't want to. Straighten that out. And that's centered. Okay, awesome. Now they have a little box to sit in. And now I just need to go. Well, first I need to eat. Um, I need to go and grab some green monos. And then I don't feel safe not having it uh, walled off up here on the um on the things but you know what i think i'll watch it for a little bit and see actually you know what i don't want to i'm not gonna watch it i'm gonna i'm gonna fix that now because then um, if i leave and it is an issue and i and i didn't see that it was it's gonna like make my chickens go everywhere and i don't need that all right these are gonna be the most misaligned fences in this build right here but it's okay as long as the chickens aren't getting out i'm okay with it for the most part now i just need to go and grab some uh i need to go grab some monos the the green kind so that they can heat holy shit it really is back in working condition oh my god everything's back in working condition that's well i was also going to work on fixing the well i'm no longer in the uh having the issue of needing batteries <laughs> that's that's a plus for a for a moment i don't need batteries at least uh let's go i'm gonna go actually i'm not even gonna go nap i just need to go find where some green monos are so that i can capture them and figure out how they work and see if i can automate them healing my my um my breeding babies. Holy shit, I almost fucking killed that one. Uh, no, no, no. I, I don't like that equipment change timer. All right, take him, take him, take him. Haha, <laughs> awesome. Well, actually I can take three more. I do have, I can literally only take three more. Um, fuck it, there's a third group right here. I'm not gonna just waste my time and say fuck it. Right. 
Uh, first try? Aw, oh, damn. All right, well, if I can't catch a full three, I'm just gonna leave. All right, so let's hope I don't screw this up. Uh, two chickens. It's, it's a good thing I kept uh, two capture prisms. What do you... What do you mean I can't summon any more chickens? You asshole. Is it because I have all these cows spawned? Might just be, but uh, I can handle that because I actually need to see if I can drop some freaking uh, expensive rare leather from them. So let's see if uh, I can. That is not what I meant to do. Uh, I'm surprised I killed all those cows and literally none of them dropped a damn um, rare leather. That makes me worried about where the hell I get it from because I really do need it. Uh, all right, chickens. Am I able to spawn some chicken? There we go. So it seems like my spawned entities have a shared cap, which means I need to go down there and kill some. Not now, but later. Um, oh, but wait, okay. I need to spawn a mono or two and... What the f... Dude, I, wait, is it left? It's the other click. Oh. Ow! Okay, you dick. So... Water does not, in fact, do anything but duplicate them. Which... Doesn't really... Yo, wait, did the chicken just... Did I have a chicken jump off the back of this thing? Do I have to put fences back here? I got distracted because the monos weren't doing what they were supposed to do. I think that is indeed what happened. Okay, you know what? I need to figure this out. Give me a second. I, I really would like to know how the hell I get my monos to, to heal. So I figured out how to do the farm. It's very simple-ish, I say. Simple-ish, because I still need some more stuff. Though I think I'm going to call it quits here for now, because in order to actually make this, um farm any better both of these actually to make either of them any better I, I do need to do a few things that um are gonna take a, a little bit of time that i just don't feel like doing at the moment okay well that's gonna be all for me today guys i hope that you guys enjoyed if you did don't forget to smack that like button drop a comment down below subscribe to the channel and turn on that bell notification so you guys do not miss when the next episode goes out and as always i hope you all enjoy the rest of the day and i will see you all next time peace